Hi there! Mabuhay! I'm Rolly and this is my view, my channel. Welcome back! So, it's actually night here in the Philippines and before I go to bed, I just have just a few discussion to uh, spend with you. Like, I just remembered my parents. Now that they are old, of course, I'm in charge of taking care of them because I happen to be single and you know, third sex people here in the Philippines, gay people, the LGBTQI group here in the Philippines, we really care for our parents. We love them so much that we want them to return whatever favor huh, we, we can give back. So, as they old, of course, we financially support them and emotionally secure them. Uh, we wanted to make them feel how they have taken care of us during our uh, time when we badly needed them. Of course, we needed them, and that uh, would not end. But it's time, really. There is that moment that we needed to return back to favor because it's our obligation. I I don't wanna be a critic of the kind of culture that we have back in the US or the foreign countries but you know I am still very proud that we don't send them to uh, the home for the age because in uh, some countries or most of the foreign countries most modern countries do send them there and of course it's it's one way uh, to give back because they are being taken care of there but here in the philippines we have that close family ties that even in the hour of death we just really have to make sure that everything is in proper order that's the reason why we go to uh, we we go insured everybody we go in by um funeral services in the future so that will not be a problem later on for our families that's really how thoughtful we are and that's how we really show to the world that we, we, we are really that close to our families uh, the thing is I just wanted to just take this moment to say thank you to my nana and tatai for being there for me like my nanny will be celebrating her 83rd birthday on March 9 I think 83rd she was born 1939 and then not my my father uh, was born 1946 and that's December 21 and it's gonna celebrate 72nd or 73rd not really like computing right now no but I think uh, those are close age huh, to what they are supposed to celebrate, and and it's really like fascinating that they have uh, that they did have that chance to to grow old. I'm really, really, really like praying to the Lord uh, to bless them with good health, have a peaceful life. Like it may be just a simple life, but I still, still wanted to give them whatever I can give them. I'm, I'm sure that I, I can just leave anywhere, if, if, just to make sure that I can send much of the help to them. It's the only thing that I could do for them not getting emotional I would just like also to mention that of course from day one uh, of our mothers giving birth to us of course it's not the normal thing that is discovered nowadays that it's it's not really that uh, exciting for a mom to 
see his, uh, I mean, her child uh, as immediate because I think there is psychological or uh, a psychological, yeah, explanation about it. And before, like, mothers would be insecure because they have a body change and really it's such an obligation. All right. I think my phone is blinking and it's telling me it's really time. I hope you like what I just shared with you and I hope you really take care of your parents, all your loved ones, while there's uh, like there's still a chance for you. God bless. Good night. I love you.